um, the whole theory. Amen. O oh God, who through Blessed Maria Skinina of the Sacred Heart of Jesus, you have given to the orphan and to the poor, a mother and to the early, elderly and sick, a sister. Grant that through her intercession and her example, we may strive to imitate Christ, your Son who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As we must have been saying, we pray for you. Sacred Heart of Jesus, we trust you. Father, I will love you more. And blessed by your Spirit, we pray for us. For us. And Sacred Heart of Jesus, we trust you. We will have here the the topic that we have to discuss is the parabola. So. The definition of the parabola The definition of the parabola is the locus of all points in the plane whose distance from a fixed fixed point F so again we will have now the focus and the fixed point line L not passing through F are the same are the same. So, we will have here the, <coughs> the focus. Ang ating focus ay uh, andito. Yung direct fix, ah, sige, yung direct fix mo na. Yung direct fix natin in the graph is dito. Ito yung letter G. Kailangan okay. yung, let, yung direct fix, hindi siya dadaanan noong uh, curve na something like letter U. Tapos, the vertex is andito sa part na yan. yan. Ito. Then, the focus is this part. Yan. So, anong pattern natin? Ang pattern natin na nabuo is the FVD. Yan. That is the pattern na kailangan natin mabuo. The pattern na meron tayo last time, ano yung pattern natin last time sa ano? <coughs> Sorry. Sa ellipse. Oh, anong pattern meron tayo sa ellipse last time? We have the center. Vertex. Focus. I thought vertex. Focus. At C, then focus, then vertex. So, tama. Center, focus, then vertex. Kaya naman, ang pattern naman natin ngayon is the uh, focus, vertex, directrix, or FBD. It's either pababa, pataas, pwede din siya siyang pakaliwa, at saka pwede din siyang pakanan. So, yun po yan. Kasi apat na yung ating opening. So, we will have here the standard equation of a parabola. Ayan, from QMAT, the math expert. The formula that we will have here is kung opening siya sa to the right, itong number 1. Kung open to the right siya, you will have y squared is equal to 4ax. And that this is the formula that you have to use. Next, kung siya naman ay opening to the left, itong number 2. Opening to the left, siya ay y squared is equal to negative 4a. Ito yung kanyang formula na susundin. Kapag naman, uh, opening uh, upward, you will have x squared is equal to negative 4ay. Ganyan. Tapos kung opening siya na downward, is x squared is equal to negative 4a. Uh, later ko na lang i-discuss yung ating na iwang ano, uh, problem last time. Kalimutan nyo nga pala yung problem papalitayo last time. So, this is how the uh, four types of equation na yun tayo. Actually, parehas lang yung 1 and 2, but nakaiba lang sila sa sign. And also, the uh, 3 and 4, makaiba lang lang sila sa sign. Okay pa.
So, ito yung ating ano, directrix. Ito yung ating D. Ito yung ating D. Vertex. At ito yung ating F. Which is the focus. So, paano natin madetermine yung kung ano, yung gano'ng kalaki yung opening kung may pag dito. So, it's depend on the letter, the value of your letter A. So, later, makikita natin kung paano kukunin yung letter A. Okay, so example natin here is the final equation of the parabola whose focus at to zero at vertex at the origin. So, in this case, kailangan muna natin siyang i-drawing again tapos you can have your focus at 0 so 1 2 click pad 1 2 ito pala siya this is 2 0 sure letter f hindi ka naka-open ka ng letter mo yan as the is the vertex at the origin so, letter B. So, paano natin makukuha yung letter D? Yung directrix. So, from letter B to letter F, meron tayong 2 units. Parehas lang sila ng sukat. So, pupunta siya dito. 1, 2. Ito yung letter D. Same lang sila ng sukat. Okay. Then, what is our formula? Ang formula natin is opening to the uh, left, ay, left, right, rather. So, magkakaroon tayo ng y squared is equal to 4ax. Now, paano natin kukunin yung letter A? Yung letter A is the distance from B to F. So, magkakaroon tayo dito, or D to B. So, this will be equal to y squared is equal to 4 times 2 then, x. So, this will be y squared is equal to 8x. Now, itong peak na to, ito yung uh, what do you call this? Yung 8 na to, ito i-divide natin sa 2. Ito 8. So, yung 8, huwag natin yung lagi dyan. So, magkakaroon tayo ng 8 divided by 2. Magkakaroon tayo ng 4. So, ibig sabihin, parang focus dito, parang, di, parang this part, may natin yung kulay. So, from here, from F, magdalagdag ka ngayon ng kapat, pataas. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 1, 2, 3, and 4. Tapat lang siya ng letter F. So, ito yung isa. Ito yung isa. And from vertex, uh, uh, oh, ganyan siya. Dadaanan dapat siya yung Ayan. So, ganyan yung magiging drop niya. Next is, we have your find the equation of the parabola whose vertex at the origin and the rentrix is the line x1. So, please try to solve this. Try natin kung magpamatch tayo ng answer. x is equal to 1 ha. Kapag sinabi natin x is equal to 1, nasa ano siya? x axis na. The rentrix x is equal to 1. So, let's try. Kung magkakaroon tayo na, let's grab first. Ayan. Ito siya na sa ating transition. Tabi nyo. So, mag-aaral tayo ng vertex at the origin. So, andito siya. So, so letter V. Tapos, sabi dyan, your x is equal to 1. My relative is equal to 1. So, andito siya. It's positive 1. So, papunta siya dito. So, letter V. So, letter V. So, papunta siya dito. So, letter V. So, nasa lang letter F. Nandito sa saan makukunda? Yes, Mendoza. 
Negative 1 po. Okay, negative 1. So, andito siya. It's negative 1. This is your letter F. So, ang graph natin ay papunta sa kaliwa. Kasi hindi siya pwede pumunta sa kanan kasi andun yung direct x. Now, the formula na meron tayo is y squared is equal to negative 4 a x. So, what is the value of our a? Our a is from f to b and b to b is uh, 1. So, magkakaroon tayo dito ng y squared is equal to negative 4 times 1 then x. So, this will be y squared is equal to negative 4 x. Now, ina na yung itadagdag natin pataas sa kapababa from letter D. From letter F, rather. Johan. Ano po? Dalawa po sa negative side po. Okay. So, dalawa. So, magkakaroon tayo dito ng 1, 2, tapos 1 and 2. Dito siya. Andito. Bakit siya naging dalawa? Kasi 4 divided by 2 is 2. So, from here, connect ko lang siya dito. Let's connect mo siya dito. And this is the graph of your parabola. Opening to the left. Okay, so let's have the equation of the parabola in standard form. Uh, an equation of the parabola having the vertex at e, each case. So therefore, it's not any more 0, 0. The focus at F, H, then K plus C. The line, the directrix is still Y is equal to K minus C. So, magkakaroon lang tayo ng x minus h then squared is equal to 4c times y minus k. Then, another is we will have here y minus k squared is equal to 4c x minus h. Yung isa is open upward or downward. Magiging negative lang siya kung siya ay open downward. Tapos, we will have y squared. Uh, yung isa naman is right and left. Magiging negative siya kung siya ay open uh, leftward. So, pakikopya po ang equation. Itong balawang. Okay, na. So let's have, let's have the example. So find the equation of the parabola with focus at 2, 5 and the rentex is equal to y. Uh, is it y is equal to negative 3. So graph muna natin ulit siya. So naroon tayo ng graph. This is 2, 5. So 1, 2, then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Ito ito siya. Ang baba lang na rin ng konti. Dito na nga siya. One, two, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, okay, F. Y is equal to negative three. So one, two, three. This is our direct matrix. Okay. So ita tapat lang natin siya don kay F. So this is your direct matrix, which is the D. Then. Ilan yung distance from F to D? Ilan yung ating units from F to D? Ito. Pangaroon tayo dito na from F to D, F to D is equal to 8. Then, i-divide natin ito ng 2. This will be 4. So, from F, bibilang ka ng 4. Pababa. 
So this will be 1, 2, 3, and 4. So itatapat lang natin dito. This will be your vertex. So tingnan natin kung apat din from V to D, apat din dapat siya. So 1, 2, 3, and 4. So apat siya. They are equals. So therefore, from F to B, Mayroon tayong uh, 4. So, therefore, this is your letter A. Okay. So, what is our equation? Our vertex has the... Anong coordinates ng vertex natin? This will be 2 and... 2 and what? 2 and 2? 2. One, two, one. This is 2 and 1. This is 1, 2. Tapos, ang katapat niya is 1. Kasi 1, 2, 3, 4. Katapat niya ay 1. So, therefore, your vertex is 2 and 1. So, this is your H. And this is the K. Now, what is the equation? Since opening siya sa pataas, kakaroon tayo dito ng... Which of the is will be x squared, x minus h squared is equal to 4c times y minus k. Okay. So, magaroon tayo dito ng x. What is our h? This is 2. From here. Ano ko? Ano ko Okay. is equal to 4 times uh, our A is 4 also then Y minus 1 so magkaroon tayo X minus 2 squared is equal to 16 Y minus 1 okay, that will be our equation Next, paano natin kukompletuhin yung graph? Meron tayo dito 16. So, 16 divided by 2 is equal to 8. So, from F, uh, from F, magdadag tayo ng 8 pa kanan, tapos 8 pa kaliwa. So, this will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Ito siya. Ganyan. Medyo malaki yung opening. Okay ba, Jeremy? Question? Clarification? Ako nga naman ba? I hope so. Okay na, kopyahin. Okay, so let's have another example. So we have find the equation parabola with vertex at 6, negative 4 and focus at negative 2, negative 4. So i-graph ulit natin siya. So magkakaroon tayo dito na... And 6 and negative 4. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4. So, dito siya nakatapat. That's your letter. That's the vertex. Then, the focus is at neg negative 2, negative 4. So, 1, 2. Dito siya. That's your letter F. Now, saan natin ilalagay ang letter T? How many units from F to B muna pala? From F to B. How many? Okay. 
8. So, magkakaroon tayo ng 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 8. So, so bakit siya naging 8? Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So, 8 ulit. So, therefore, from your letter F, uh, F, B, B. From your letter B pala, rather, is mag-a-add tayo ng another 8 sa kanan. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And this will be your the red tricks or letter B. So, andito siya sa part na yan. Then, what is your letter A? Your letter A is equal to 8. Medyo malaki-laki to pag binarap. Pag 6-5 pa din pala siya. So, what is the opening? It's open to the right, left, downward, or upward. Right. Papunta siya sa right. Since nandito yung letter P natin, papunta siya dito sa right. Bawal siya dito sa right or left? Dito sa may left. Oo, oh, dito sa left. Papunta sa left. Kasi po Kasi, na sa left. Oo, oh, <laughs> yan nga. O, oh, left nga. Papunta sa left. <laughs> Kasi siya na nag-auto up yung aking gum. So therefore, what is our equation? Can you give the equation? This will be, we're going to use y, we're going to use x. Y po. Y, so y minus h squared k pala. So, h k nga pala. Y minus k is equal to negative 4k. Then, x minus h. So, what is our vertex? Our vertex is 6 and negative 4. So, this is our h and this is our k. So, magkaroon tayo ng y minus. Since negative and negative, this will be positive. Y is positive. Kasi negative na ito ha. Tapos, mag-multiply mo ito siya kay negative. So, magiging positive. So, magkaroon ng squared. It's equal to 4. Our a is also is 8. Malakit ka lang ito. Then, x minus 6. So, y plus 4 squared is equal to 4 times 8 is 32. Then, x minus h. Now, sobrang laki ni 32. Kapag i-divide mo kasi 32 divided by 2, the answer is 16. Hindi ka siya. Kaya, imagine nyo na lang na ay 16 tayo. Basta pa ganito yung graph na. Pero yung ano, from F, from F pataas, meron ka dapat 16. Tapos from F pababa, meron ka dapat din 16. Ganun siya kalaki. Question? Wala naman? Pag-copy mo na. Find the equation parabola with vertex at 2 negative 4 and directrix x is equal to negative 5. So, again, we have to graph this. Muna. Sabi dito, 2 and negative 4. So, 1, 2, then 1, 2, 3, 4. This is our vertex. The identity is x is equal to negative 5. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, letter D. Now, meron tayo dito from uh, B to B. Ilan yung, so, ilan yung units niya from B to B? 7 po. 7. Therefore, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So, magkakaroon tayo ng F. Mag-add tayo ng 7 to the right. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 5, 6, and 7. And this will be your F. Ayan. Now, papunta sa ng ating graph. It's opening to the right. So, papunta na siya sa right, ha? So, therefore, we have to use the uh, Y minus 
k squared is equal to 4 a and x minus h. So in this case, so we have our this will be uh, h and this is your k. So we have y. Why? Parang sa buto natin para nila. This is positive for a let. Is equal to 4 times 7, then x minus 2, then y plus 4 squared is equal to 4 times 7 i 28 x minus 2. So, kung i divide natin yung 28 divided by 2, magkakaroon tayo dito ng 14. So, 14 pataas from letter F, then 14 pababa from letter F. So, imagine na may 14 tayo. Pag-ganyan siya. Okay. Yung ating parabola. So, let's have this. Uh, given, we have here the x squared minus 8x minus 10y is uh, minus 34 is equal to 0. So, in this part, kailangan natin siyang uh, uh, i-reverse into the simplest form to determine the given. So, magkakaroon tayo dito ng x squared minus 8x minus 10y minus 34 is equal to 0. So, kung sasama-samahin ulit natin, again, Wardy, Pablo, and Prit. Magkakaroon tayo dito ng x squared. Minus 8x, tapos is equal to uh, 10y. So, paano natin siya i-ano kung siya ba ay nasa x or nasa y? So, ang um, uh, anahin natin is based on the sino ba yung might squared sa given. So, mag-aaroon tayo dito ng 10y, then lipat natin siya dito, tapos lilipat natin dito 34, so plus 34 dito. Tapos, you can have x squared minus 8x plus, ano i-add natin? It's equal to 10y plus 34 plus yung i-add. What are going to add? So, we have x squared minus 8x plus what are going to add? Miss Borromeo. Hmm. Ilan? 5 Mas brokin yan ang sagot Lag ka Pachat na lang po ang sagot 16 po Okay, 16 Okay, 16 This will be 16. So, magkakaroon tayo ng x squared. Minus 8x. So, paano naging 16 yan? Ito yan ay ginagamit na natin last time pa kung paano naging 16. So, ano na. So, 10y, 10, 34 plus 16. What is 34 plus 16? Ang dosa. 50 po. Okay, so this is 50. So, plus 50. So, this part, itong part na ito ay gagamitan natin siya ng square of binomial. What is the square of binomial of this part? You have uh, Ano po? X Minus What? X minus 4 squared. Minus 4 po, squared po. Oh, okay. Squared is equal to, ito ang part na to, gamitan natin siya na CMF, Common Monomial Factor. What is the CMF? 10 y plus 50. Tapik lang natin yung kahapon. Cedric. Sir, ano po yung tanong? Ano ang CMF ng 10Y at saka 50?
they are divisible in 10. So therefore, magkaroon ka dito ng y plus what? This will be 5. So yan, uh, yung ha naka-open cam, ay uh, open mic. Okay? That is the CMF of 10y plus 50. Now, we can now have the vertex. Now, the vertex is equal to 4 and negative 5. So, saan siya galing? Ito, tsaka ito. That's the vertex. That is the value of your HK. The next is we have to find for the... Uh, I ano natin pala siya. I-determine natin ano yung opening niya. Is this open upward, downward, left, or right? We have x, our basis is x. So therefore, kung x siya, saan siya mapupunta? Hmm. Anyone? Saan ang kaliwa? Taas o ano? Taas po at baba. O, taas o baba. Since positive yung 10 natin, so therefore, this is a upward. Yan, upward siya. So, here, magkakaroon tayo ng kung siya upward, ang ating F will be what? H and K plus C or A. May natin K plus A. Kasi A yung ginamit natin. How we're going to determine our A? So, magkakaroon tayo dito ng to find A. Magkakaroon tayo na ng value ng A natin ay 10. Saan siya galing? Dito, di ba? That's our 10. That's our A. Then, we have to divide this by 4. Bakit 4? Kasi based on our formula, ang ating formula is x minus h squared is equal to 4a y minus k. Ito yung kinukuha natin na 4a. Ang value ng a, itong pinakabalyo nito is 10. So, to find this, kailangan natin siya divide by 4. So, therefore, yung a natin is equal to how many? 10 divided by 4. This is 10 over 4. It is what it is. This will be equal to 5 over 2, which is equal to 2.5. Tama? 2.5. So, therefore, magkakaroon tayo dito ng F is equal to, ang ating H is equal to negative 5. Uh, no, it's 4. So, negative 5 plus 2.5. So, yung F natin is equal to 4 and negative 5 plus 2.5 still negative 2.5 So, ito yung isa. Ito yung isang F1. Ha, ah, yung focus pala. Okay pa. Next is we have now the first we have now the focus direct clicks. Paano daw yung direct tricks? Anyone? Kung dalito kayo, yeah, i-grab ulit natin. Sabi dyan, mayroon tayong 4 and negative 5. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. Type yeah, and then yung ating vertex. Then the focus is four and two point five. Nothing F. It's two point five. What will be our D? So, meron tayo from F to B, ay meron tayong 2.5. What is our D? 
Mag-add po pababa. mag ng ng 2.5 pababa. Since ang ating uh, uh, tag dito, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, magkakaroon tayo ng, mag a tayo ng, from negative 5, mag a tayo ng another negative 2.5. So, therefore, magkakaroon tayo ng negative 7.5. Bakit siya naging negative 7.5? Kasi, uh, itong ating given ay naandito na. So, sa negative 5. So, mag a tayo ng dalawa dito, ng 2.5. So, ano, papapatakan siya ng negative 5 plus negative 2.5. So, this will be equal to negative 7.5. Now, what is our axis of symmetry? Kapag sinabi natin axis of symmetry, is kung saan siya dumaang x-axis. So, dina dumaan yung ating mga given sa x is equal to positive 4. Ito, dito kasi siya dumaan. Lahat. Axis. Ang pinag-usapan natin is, is the x-axis, the axis of symmetry.